Well, hello, hello. So we have a box today. Um, because Segoy Mark came out with the Lucky Bag 20, 2022. And uh, it's probably about the only Lucky Bag I'm going to get. Out of everything. Because I do love a good Lucky Bag. But sometimes you just can't. So, um, also I ordered a couple of extras to go with it to make the shipping worth the while. So, the extras I ordered. Melty Kiss. Whee! I do love a good Melty Kiss. And a, another one of these Pokemon bath bomb things. Because the last time I ordered one, like six months ago, something like that. No, longer than that. Mm, God, maybe eight months ago. Anyway, I got a, a little Charmander dude. Kind of hoping maybe this time I'd get an Eevee. Or even a Pikachu. Um, either way, my Charmander needs a buddy. At my desk. So, oh. Ooh, this might be a, a good lucky bag. There's something very plushy in here. Ugh, there's also a sticker. Woo, our usual sticker. But, let me toss that up. So yeah, something very plushy in here. I don't know what it is, but it looks interesting. So, um, let's find out, shall we? Okay, so... This is our lucky bag, 2022. They're supposed to be a um, hundred dollar value in here. Let's find out. There is so, I, and I only paid like fifty bucks for this thing. So, yeah, there's supposed to be $100 worth in here. So, I really want to find out what this plushie is. It's, it's a, it's a thing. It's, oh, it's a little cat head pillow. Oh, you're so cute. I love this. I love this. So, for you, if I pronounce that correctly. If I didn't, I'm sorry. And, and just ignore the white chick over here. Um, so the big one... So there's a bunch of them. Oh. Cherry Hilba. Either way, this is adorable. I love this. Um and I have I have my computer up on the page so I can see if I can try and find these items on the website. And if not, well, you know what I'll do? I'll go to the other website that's on on the tag. Yep, and it looks like I'm going to have to go to the, the one on the tag. But I, I love this. Look at this. This is a great reading pillow. Oh, oh it's that's awesome. I'm I'm in love with this thing already. This is great. The only problem is, is I have a friend coming to spend the night in, in a couple of days um, because I have to take her to the airport for things and stuff and uh, she may see this and try and steal it and I can't let that happen no no I'm realizing I'm starting to get a lot of things in my life that my friends would love to steal from me and <laughs> it's kind of getting to the point I kind of have to hide a lot of my my toys and stuff so, yeah. Um, you know, that whole website is just... It's in Japanese, because of course it is. Um, so we're not going to worry about it. We're, we're just going to do... Ooh. Oh. Did I just find it? Maybe, possibly? Maybe we just do the things. Oh, I did find the page, but still... They call these the sleepy cat pillows, is what they call them. So, it has a lot of info and not a lot of info, if that makes any sense whatsoever. So yeah, there's a whole whole set of... Oh, they even have little mice. That's so cute. Okay, I'm, I'm just rambling now. Okay, so... 
I don't, I don't know where I'm going to, we're just going to put the, <laughs> of course, I, I never clear off enough space. We're going to put the cat plushie, the sleepy kitty plushie on the side because there's more things in this bag. Um, so we got a gentle steam eye mask. Ooh, that could be comfy. Um, just trying to grab into the bag. What we got here? Some sort of noodle snackage. Oh, it's a package of those, um, the noodles that you put like on, on top of your, your uh, Asian salad or whatnot. I can't think of what they're, what they're called, but they're yummy. Um, let's see. Grab this. What? Vasa's Das. So... Oh, I know this series. I know the series. I can't think of what the heck the series is. Um, yeah, because there's that annoying little boo dude. Demon something. Um, Cause I know there is a dub version of it that used to show on CW. Like right before Digimon or something. I just can't think of the the name of it. This thing. Which I know you guys can't see my screen, but that's fine. Yokai Watch! That's what I was thinking of. Okay. So we have a playing card and a set of chop and chopsticks from Yokai Watch. Um this is probably gonna go up on Mercari, just to be honest, because I don't really play or or watch that series. Um, Rascal twenty two. Oh, you have a wonderful day. Oh, this is so cute. Oh, I got two of them. I'm sure they didn't mean to do that. Oh, but it's cute. That's so adorable. I have no use for this, but it's so cute. Maybe I'll give one to to my buddy. That's spending the night. Ask her, hey, you need a a thing? I know you do. Um, let's see, so what we got? Oh, more of these little um, Sakura candies. Latte. I've gotten these before, and I don't remember if I liked them or not. I think I did. Um, I just don't remember. Yeah, I think I did like those. But, you know. Oh, I feel a dish of some sort in here. What do we got? Oh, cinnamon roll. So wonderful to enjoy all time favorites in a quaint little cafe with a yesteryear vibe. You know, I didn't keep the mug. I ended up giving the cinnamon roll mug to somebody else at my office because she really, that's her favorite character uh, from San Diego. But I think I'm going to keep this because this is cute. This is like super cute. We, we may just keep this as my my reading snacks plate. Um, yeah. And it looks like it's kind of the same thing as with the other dish I'd gotten from like a Soquai or something. There was a really Kuma bowl I got. It's really, and it's great for noodles, but you can only hand wash it. You can't put it in the dishwasher or anything. Um, let's see. Bases das. Oh! Dragon Ball Battle of Saiyans Volume 6. So. Oh, it's a blind. Oh, I was going to say it's a blind box, but no, it's. It's checked which one it is. Uh, yeah. So this will probably go. <laughs> I mean, I do, I do like Dragon Ball Z. I've got a younger brother and we fight on the TV for. Well, actually, we didn't have to fight because Dragon Ball Z came on right before Sailor Moon. So we'd both sit there and watch each other's shows. But I, I'm not a big enough fan of, of Dragon Ball Z to want to keep this. But, I mean, so far, we're, we're getting our money's worth. This is actually much better than last year's. So, um, what do we got? We got some sort of make-your-own-snackage thing. Um, cheesy pizza. Is this like a gummy thing that's supposed to look like pizza? No, no, there's a microwave thing. Uh, 
That still looks like a gummy treat. Well, it's still, it's still a make your own snackage type deal. <laughs> Popping cooking. Okay, so it abs it has to be some sort of gummy treat. It has to. Um, let's see what the website says. What? Um, let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, here we go. Poppin' Cookin' Pizza Party Kit is what it is. A fun do-it-yourself treat which makes you feel like you're running your own pizzeria. More fun can make your own candy featuring a pizza theme. English instructions not included. Okay, that's fine. Um, so six bucks for that. Uh, let's see if there's anything else in here. Okay, there's one last thing in the bag. I know it was in here because they always include it. So more... Apple Cinnamon Kit Kats, which will make my hairstylist very happy because he does like these. So, okay, do, 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 do. I know I'm rambling. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Only a little. Okay, so we'll go six bucks for the popping candy and then. Kit Kat. Apple cinnamon, 10 bucks. Okay. And I'll be honest, you know what I've done with a lot of these lucky bags, or if not all of the lucky bags I've gotten, because I think I've gotten a number of them over the last couple of years. These are great for grocery shopping. Or going to Target or something, especially because in my little part of the country, um, they're going to start uh, doing a tax for if you don't have your own shopping bags, a plastic bag will now cost you like 23 cents, which I'm fine with that. But this is also yeah, a great way for me to try and remember um, to uh, pack a shopping bag. So, let's see if I can't find these. Okay, so there's the Kome. Oh, okay, so... Oh! So, candies made of Japanese plums is what they are. Oh, okay, so it's a plum candy. Now I remember these. I did like them. They were kind of a weird taste, but I did like them. Um... Okay, and then uh, let's see. Let's see if I can find the schedule books. Well, I found some of them. But not all of them. This is a A6 size. Uh, the only ones showing up are Sailor Moon. Taylor Mooney ones. I bet. I bet I could probably find it. So. No, that's not it. That's definitely not it. Oh. <sighs> Uh, 
Oh, here we go. So, yes, it's the schedule book. Um, and it's going online for $38 Hong Kong. Um, so let's do Hong Kong to dollar. So four eighty seven. So plus four eighty seven plus four eighty seven because we got two of them. Which I'm sure they just they didn't mean to have them stuck together like that. But they are cute, and I'm sure I can find a good home for them. Uh, so so far we're up to thirty bucks. Yo, Kai, watch. Let's see what comes up for Yo, Kai, watch. Nothing. We we get an onsen bucket and an ongiri mold. So let's see, chopsticks and a playing card. Okay, so I found it, and on Amazon it's going for ten fifty-five. So let's see. I know I'm trying so hard to go quick for you guys, because <laughs> there's there's things and stuff. Um. Dragon Ball. So let's look. Oh, they got a paper theater in Dragon Ball? Cool. See, that I would probably be willing to do. Cable bites. Playing cards. Big Bang. Let's uh, let's do it this way. Battle of the Saints. Okay, that one I found. So that is ten bucks as well. Um, you know I'm not gonna bother to look up these rice things. They're so yummy. I'm gonna go with three bucks for these. Why? Because they probably are. Um, the eye steam. So we got an individual one. Uh, three bucks. Okay. And then we got a cinema roll plate. And let's see if I can't find one similar to it. And I would go with this is probably a medium sized plate. So 15 bucks. Okay. So we're at 72. Which means this plushie, this this giant plushie, which I'm so in love with. <laughs> I can't, I just can't stop squeezing it. It's so awesome. Uh, this is probably going to go for 30 if I had to guess. Um, actually, let's take a, let's take a gander. For you sleeping cat. 
plush. Oh, not plus. Plush. Typing's hard. Okay. So... Yeah, so these are going for about 35 bucks second hand. So, ah, no. So that brings our grand total to 107. It's supposed to have a hundred dollar value. We we met that mark. So yay, woohoo. I, I love this thing, I can't stop petting it. This is fabulous. Forget the rest of the box, this is the awesome part of it. Um, I love that it has little back feet too. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, so anyway, all right. So we're at 20 minutes already, good grief. And there are, are more videos coming this month. I did do the, I've got a couple of Ipsy bags coming this month. I've got the January bag and the Cosmic Mystery bag coming. Um, the Marvel, Funko Marvel Collector Core uh, is coming at the end of the month and it's Marvel Studios slash Disney Plus theme. So we'll see what happens there. I thought for sure they were gonna do Spider-Man, but maybe that's uh, March, I don't know. Um, still haven't gotten the November box from Loot Crate for Marvel Gear and Goods. The January box for Marvel Gear and Goods is, um, good question. I don't know. I, I can't really find any info on it, so I have no idea if it's actually coming out or not. Um, the Unplugged Book Box, I did the limited edition winter, or cozy winter, so there's three books in there. Um, and I did see one of the items in there. It's, it's, it's a really nice thing. I'm going to enjoy the heck out of it. And no, I'm not going to tell you what it is because it'll be amazing when it gets here. Um, what else we got? I, oh, uh, and the other Japan Crate box, which is, uh, the January Doki Doki and it's Year of the Tiger theme because of course Lunar New Year or Chinese New Year is February 1st, which is a Tuesday. Well, I say it that way because, you know, February 2nd of 22, or, yeah. Ooh, that means people were wrong. Ooh, because people were saying that February 2nd, 2022 is a Tuesday, so it truly is a Tuesday, but they're wrong, I think. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, February 1st is a Tuesday. Um, so yeah, uh, and then Pi Day is, or Valentine's Day, I should say, is a Monday. Oof. Well, good thing I'm single. Um, <laughs> and then, and then, and then, and then, and then, what else we got? I think that's everything for this month, and then there really shouldn't be anything coming next month except for the Ipsy bag, and I'm trying to par down. Um, I'm still trying out new things every now and then, but I'm trying to part down the spending because I decided I want to buy a house next month, or not next month, next year. So 2023 um, is when I'm going to buy a house. And it looks like it's going to cost me a really good chunk of money because housing prices where I live are really expensive. And uh, so we'll have, we'll have all the things going on then. God, I, I just can't stop petting this thing. This is wrong. This is so wrong. Anyway, um, that's all I got for you guys. And I'll probably see you in a couple of days when the Ipsy bag shows up or whenever Doki Doki shows up or, you know, whatever mysterious things show up at my house that I may have purposely or inadvertently bought. So, yeah, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!